Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to create your own verification system for your server. So, basically what I have in my server, um, you go to rules and verify, and you have to click this little check mark right here to get access to the whole server. So I'm going to be teaching you how to do that on this test server. So the first step, and probably the most important step, is you have to go to appearance, and turn on this developer mode right here so you can copy um, message IDs and user IDs and stuff so once we have that we want to go to carl.gg I'll leave the link in the description in the description sorry um, and then you just want to invite him by going to manage and you can just manually invite him from there so we already have him in the server so the next step what you want to do is you need to go to server settings rules and you have to go to at everyone. So this is it should be your only role unless you've made some other ones. Um, and what you want to do is you want to check this read text channels and see voice channels and check it off. And you want to create a new one. Um, like call it like verified or something. It doesn't really matter. And you can just give it a color or something. And then, but the most important thing is so you can customize everything else to whatever you want. But this thing has to be on. Read text channels and see voice channel. This has to be on. So let's save the changes. Let's escape. And then after that, what we're going to do is so for this server, we have um, an explanation point as a prefix. So whatever you have for a prefix in my server, I have a question mark. But yeah, so you just put that and you put RR. And then Carlbot's going to give you a list of. Um, of directions on how to add your own reaction role. So what we have to do is type a message such as um, to gain access to this server, check the, and then just put whatever emoji you want. Um, I use a check mark, this one right here, to gain access, um, no, to get the verified role. Okay, so now we have this message, but there's nothing here, right? So what you have to do is, um, so you go here, and then you literally just do exactly what it says. It gives you perfect instructions. Exclamation point, react, roll, add, channel is rules, and then message ID. So this is where the developer mode comes in play. You click more, and copy ID. You, um, you just press control V there and then you do your emoji which is whatever you put here uh, so we're gonna put that there and then the rule so we already created the rule so let's add that right there so at verified and I guess you could add a space there if you want and then boom here we have the check mark so as you can see let's get rid of everything here so, so right now I have no uh, roles, right? If I check this, I get the verified role. So now, how you can check that this actually works is you go, hold on, let me get rid of this. Let's go to test server, server settings, roles, and you want to go to add everyone and view the server as the role. So here we can only see rules. But the thing is, you j you actually need to do one more step before this because otherwise they can't see the rules. And you go to permissions, and you need to check uh, read messages on for at everyone. Okay, so they can actually see the channel, so they can get the rule. And then for general, you wanna you wanna go to the um, settings permissions. And make sure that at everyone cannot read the messages. But say if I add this here, as soon as they get this rule, they can. So that's how you can easily do that. And then to test it, obviously you go to rules, view server as ev at everyone. You go select rules. As soon as I click on verified, here are the ch voice channels and text channels. So um, that would be it. Um, if you want to join my Discord server, link is in the description. Um, also the carl.gg, his link is in the description as well. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.